Hello everyone and welcome back to the next episode of my Pokemon Platinum Eevee Challenge! In the previous episode we defeated the guys in Veilstone, uh, Team Galactic, and now we are going to get our Mount Coronet on. However, I cannot remember what I'm supposed to be doing right now, so... Um, yeah, I'm just gonna, like, just have a little look around. Um, in the team you can see, actually, I need to just real quick swap some people around. Uh, we're gonna be switching these two dudes around. Um, yeah, so, I mean, I had to <laughs> clearly drop a couple of people, so these are the guys I've got now. I don't know whether this is good or bad. Um, we'll see. Um, I'm ho oh, see, oh, I don't know. The problem is like, having to have the, the HM people in the, in the team means that I've, I've got to drop a couple of Eevees and and this could be a problem because I don't because uh, we're gonna have to fight Team Galactic and um, I can't remember what Pokemon they've got and so I maybe maybe I maybe I may have made a miscalculation. I need to go ahead and pop on a repel as well. I can't remember whether this is the right way to go or not. I don't even know. I have a little map, but it doesn't seem to make any sense to me. So we're just gonna have a little wander around and uh, see what's what. Uh, where? What? Please don't tell me I have no repels. Oh, yes I do. I have t Oh, I have ten. Brilliant. That's just great. Um, anyway, so we're just gonna have a little wander around and see if we can... Yeah, right, let's go ahead and defog, because this is... Defog. This is the way that we need to go, I think. Um, unfortunately, well, it might not be the way to go, but I'm kind of like, I'm not even sure right now. I'm not even sure. We're going to get on this surfing. If, uh, if I'm struggling to know where to go, then clearly what I will do is I will just nab that light clay right there real quick. Um, I'll just stop the recording and start it again when I actually find how to, to be where I need to be. Uh, but we'll just we'll just surf about and we'll see what we can find and all of that good stuff. So I know that um, at some point we're going to be finding Team Galactic, finishing them off, and I guess going to the distortion world. So the problem is, I don't know um, how this is going to play out with um, just having these four evolutions. But there's nothing I can do about it because, dudes, I'm not going to teach my Eevees... HM moves. I mean, I guess I could, but I'm not going to do that because then I would have to take it off them and relearn. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, that's not happening. Um, I'm just going to go grab these items, I guess. Maybe this isn't the right way. I feel like it should be the right way, though. Can I? Oh, I can get on my bike. Powerful. Um, okay, so let's just grab this real quick. Um, there's going to be like admins and stuff and go into the distortion world and all of that good stuff with four Eevees. I'm not happy about that particularly, but I really don't know what else I can do. There's not, I'm really not feeling that there's anything else I can do about it. So, um, we'll have to see how we get on. Uh, and then it's Sunny Shore. Final gym battle. Happy days. Well, there's two ways out. Let's go this way. Or is this the way? Oh, I hate Mount Coronet. It confuses the crap out of me. It's like this is the way. This is the way to Lake Acuity. I'm, I think. It's like I need to climb up there. How do I get up there? I don't think I've been up there. Let's go this way. I don't know. We'll see. Yeah, we haven't been this way yet, so maybe maybe this is the way to go. I don't know. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna keep going. If I end up recording a whole bunch of stuff that's no good, then then uh, yeah, I'll just keep recording until I get to the place I need to be. <laughs> to be honest, um, that might mean that that might mean that I uh, cut some of this out or whatever. But we'll see. Uh, well, that was great. Um, I'm hoping that I've got a decent uh, a decent selection. Maybe I should have left Moonlight behind. I brought Moonlight because Moonlight is bulky. 
um, but it doesn't necessarily know any decent moves. I might have to see if I can teach it any HM moves that, or TM moves that, that might benefit. Give it a bit more coverage. There's, at the moment it's just got dark coverage, it's got that confuse ray as well, but... Um, I don't need to branch out. Ba -ba -ba, surf! Okay, you can, yeah, yeah, okay. Back off, Rapid Ash. Just catch this surf. Okay, that's fine. Right. The hail continues to fall. Blah, blah, blah. Sudowoodo. Well, you're going to have to be, Martin. As you can see as well, I also leveled up my Pokemon a little bit in between episodes. We're all up to about level 45, including the guys that are in the PC. Except for Junior, I think he's still level 41. But yeah, we leveled up a little bit, so I, uh, I, I felt like we, perhaps that might be beneficial. So the next section of the recording, if we were just slightly higher level than we actually are, were. Um, oh, this isn't the right way. How do I get up there? Oh, I don't even know. I'm looking for somewhere to... Ah, rock climb. Let's climb. Because now we have rock climb, we can get up here. Maybe it's this way. Maybe it is, maybe it isn't. But I feel like we need to start on the outside and then... And then we go inside. I feel like I feel like that's what I can remember happening before in the past when I've done this about a hundred million moons ago. A hundred million moons ago. Right. Okay. So Black Belt Philip has him a choke. But that's okay because we have got Xavier. So Xavier can come on in and bop this Machoke real quick. Yeah. Not very effective, mate. Are you gonna? Ah, oh, now. Ah, oh, the other thing I have to think about, right, is that I picked up the um, TM for Psychic just before I started recording. Um, I climbed up this rock wall and found Psychic, so I could teach that to Xavier. But Xavier learns it at, like level sixty something, so it's like, do I? I mean, is there any point in me teaching him it? I want him to know it now, but if I could maybe use it on a different um, Eevee, that might give me a little bit more coverage. Maybe, um, maybe. Um, Maybe Moonlight could learn Psychic. That might be that might be kind of cool. And we have a Swinub. Um, so yeah, we learned, didn't we? That that we need to surf these things. Bam. Okay. I'm also concerned that this is going to be a mega massive episode of me wandering around again. And a Snova Ice Grass. Brilliant. Um, let's go into Sparks, and we'll use the double kick and see what happens. Double kick! Ice shard. Eat that up. Go on, eat that up. Yeah. Uh, yeah, that's not bad. That's not bad. We can do one more of those. Okay. Ice shard is priority, you see. That's, that's, that's why that got, that got in there first. Um, okay, so that's fine. We're not doing too bad right now. I feel like this could be the way to go as well, so hopefully, hopefully it is. Hopefully it is. Hopefully, I have my fingers crossed that this is the right way to go. I'm skiing right now, but okay. But okay, as we skiers say, spur thing. What? You don't even make any sense. Skier Bradley. Sending out a snorrent. So, I guess we're just going to do that thing again where we send out sparks. Because we don't have bear, our fire type. So all of these um, ice types are just going to have to get bopped by a double kick instead. Nice! and powerful critical hit. Ooh. Okay. Hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo now. Hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo. Swin up. Hopefully I've got some potions. Oh, I, just, I always forget to go and buy potions. I think we might need to, though. Oh, my life. We'll see if this is the right way to go anyway first, and if it is then I might cut out, go to the shops and then come back again. Snova! Maybe I ought to also just see if Moonlight can learn anything. Double kick! He's going for the ice shard, but we're going to eat that up. Yes we are. Yes we are. That is not bad. That is not bad. We need to heal up Sparks real bad. Okay, that's super effective. I'm happy with that. We're getting some level. Well, XP, not levels. Not levels! Right, let's go. Let's go, man. I feel that we have hardly any potions. We have nine. That is not enough. 
Um, at least they're hyper potions. I'm gonna hit Martin with that hyper potion too. Okay, right, so let's keep going. There's an item. Oh, don't tell me that I went all this way just for an item and there's nothing else here. That would really annoy me. A mental herb. A mental herb. I don't need a mental herb. Oh no, I think this could be the right way. There's another skier there. We've got a HP up, which is okay, I guess. Oh, it's so annoying that you that to like get through these places you need all of the... Um... Oh my goodness. Are you telling me that this, is, this place is just full of potions and I'm not even going the right way? Please don't tell me that. Please don't tell me. Oh, uh, you are going to tell me that. Like, I came all this way for nothing. Well, I guess I'm going to have to try another entrance to Mount Coronet. Oh, this is so annoying. Um, I mean, just really, this is so annoying. Okay, fine. So we'll fight this guy and then I'm going to fly somewhere else and try it try a different place. And also go to the shop and buy some more stuff. And this episode might end up being like a ginormous episode, but I've been trying to cut them down recently, so maybe this is, maybe it'll be okay that this one's a bit longer. Hopefully you guys will stick through to the end. <laughs> I'm not sure how many of you guys actually stick through to the end of my videos. Um, I, I, I apologise if they're really boring. <laughs> Especially now in Platinum when I don't quite know where I'm going. But it's not this way. Which way? Which way is it? Darn it! Ice beam. Oh well, we did get ice beam, so that's not bad. Um. Okay, fine. Let's grab Amy a second. Should we try this way? There are like only a certain amount of ways that we can get into Mount Coronet. I feel like. I just feel like I'm missing something. There must be. I'm. Uh, Anyway, I'm going to fly over here. I'm going to go to the shops. And what I think I'll do is I'll cut out until I get back to the right place. Because there is no point in me commentating on all my failed attempts to get into Mount Coronet. Because that's just really annoying. So guys, what I'm going to do is just going to heal up here. Real quick. Come on. Come on, Joy. Okay, so guys, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go buy some stuff, find the right way into Mount Coronet, and I'll come back when I'm sorted. Okay, guys? So I'll see you in a minute. Hello, guys. I'm back, and I ran into a Team Galactic Grunt on my journey who said that I needed to get in Mount Coronet from the Orba City side. So now I'm hoping that this is the way to go. Don't think it's that way. So that's how I've got my fingers crossed that this galactic guy was telling me. He was giving me good advice. I mean, you know, I'm not sure how trustworthy these guys are, but he said you could only get in from the Orba city side, I think. So let's see. Come on, let's do this. I'm kind, I'm kind of hope, hopefully a bit confident now. Although Team Galactic guys, do, what do they know, I guess? Orba Gate... It's like, and I need surf, he said, too, so maybe this way? I don't know. <sighs> I think maybe he was just, like, throwing me, sending me on a wild goose chase. That's because that's... This is... This doesn't seem to be... This isn't... Oh, no, well, we haven't we haven't been this way before, so let's just see. Okay, I'm veteran. Don't treat me like a senior citizen. Okay. And you have a Riolu, and you are near to my level, so hopefully this is... Hopefully this is sending us in the right direction now. Come on. Get bopped, Riolu. Martin levels up too, which is nice and powerful. And we're not going to switch out, because that Graveler is going to get bopped as well by a Surf. Surf, 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 Surf. Okay, cool. It didn't actually take me that long to figure this out now. I think I just, I was lucky. Right, go Sparks. You're gonna bop this Staraptor right now real quick. <laughs> hey, and I tell you what, this is Friday morning. Obviously it's my day off, I'm recording. Um, and Mega Beedrill and Mega Pidgeot have been announced uh, in the Korokoro Leak 
Mega Pidgeot's pretty happy about that. I don't mind Pidgeot getting a getting a Mega. And actually, oh no, this isn't the right way. What is going on? Oh, seriously, seriously, this drives me absolutely mental. Well, I'm just going to grab this stuff anyway. Anyway, this must be the right way. This must be the right side. He told me I needed to go this way. He's like, yo, Beck, you need to go this way. And you need Surf. So I'm just going to... I'm just going to keep wandering around, I guess. Yeah, so Mega Pidgeot. I'm happy, pretty happy with that. Pidgeot is definitely one of my favourite Gen 1 Pokemon. Um, nice and powerful flying type. So I'm happy with that. Mega Beedrill. Well, I have been saying for a while that it seems a shame that like Pokemon like that don't get to be used as effectively as you would like them to be. So that's kind of nice. It would be nice if uh, be, be, if uh, Weedle got some egg moves as well so that you could properly... Oh. How do we do that? I have been this way before. This is really annoying. It's like... Dudes. This is really super annoying. I have been this way before. Um, yeah, it would be nice if, uh, if uh, in Oras that uh, Weedle got some the ability to get some egg moves as well. That would be that would be pretty powerful and cool. So you could actually like set up a Beedrill nice nicely, nicely, nice and powerful Beedrill. Um, it just reminds me of in my my ill-fated Vault White Two randomizer, uh, random lock. I got that Beedrill from um, from fishing. I got a Weedle from fishing and called it Duck. And actually, because it's Dreano hack, Beedrill had been kind of um, buffed, so that it it was it was actually pretty decent. It had um, cross poison and something else, Excisor, and it was pretty powerful. So this isn't the way. Oh, for goodness' sake, I hate this game sometimes. It's like it drives me absolutely mental. It's not that way either, because that's just the way that I went. And there was no way to go with that surfing. I mean, really, what's the point of this if there's nowhere to go with the surfing? Da -da 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 -da. There's no, there's no rock climb ability. There's just nothing. Great. He definitely said you need to go in from the Orberg City side. So it's like, well, I'm in Orberg City right now. I came to this side because you told me that this was the way to get up to the top of Mount Coronet, but you clearly was lying to me. It's really annoying. Let's see what else there is going on in Olberg City. Olberg Gate Place. No, no, no. No. Route 203. Dang, damn it. Oh, I don't want a random encounter. Please tell me. Please tell me where to go. Okay, I might cut just. I might end up cutting this bit out because it's derpy. Anyway, uh, I'm going to go back to uh, trying to find out where to go. So I'll, I'll see you when I get there. Okay, guys. So I'm back, and I realised I made a derp, and that I was looking in the Orberg Gate, not in Mount Coronet. So here we are at the Orberg side of Mount Coronet. So let's see if we can get this done. As you can see, also I've really quickly swapped out Amy because I'm not sure I'm going to need that Fly Slave anymore. Um, I'm not sure I'm going to need that. I think um, Fly and Defog are not going to be necessary. So I went ahead and took the liberty of adding Bear back onto the team. Because Bear is probably my most powerful evolution right now. And um, if we're going to be taking on some admins, then I want the power of uh, those Pokemon. So hopefully that'll be fine. I need to stick on a Repel again as well, I think. But anyway. Machoke! Run away, run away. Run away, Martin. I'm going to pop that Repel on right now. Okay, so hopefully now we are going the right way through Mount Coronet because there was the surf and the rock climb and I'm feeling that this is probably the right way to go. Okay, let's get up here. Um, I'm scared. I just want to get there now, you know? I want to just kind of like get this, get this moving because it's been ages. That looks interesting over there. Yeah. I've been kind of wandering around for ages, and, um... Oh, here we go, it's Looker. Yes, we are on the right track. Excellent. Observe, if you will, that hole. There was once a cave painting that had blocked the way to the summit. But the wall it is no longer there. It lies in pieces, do you see? 
ever since the three Pokemon of the lakes have been captured. Something terrible is happening, but what exactly I do not know. Burr is one, burr is but one cause, Team Galactic Cyrus. And now, we are all caught up. Now, Slurr, are you trainer enough to advance? Show me, if you will. Haha, you can relax. You can relax now, you see, I understand. You are far superior to me, as are the Commander Cyrus, too, naturally. Team Galactic is beyond my reach. Please, you must stop them, for only you are able. All I can do now is give you this. It is a little something I obtained in an investigation long ago, the Black Flute. Please, you must stop Team Galactic. I mean, seriously, look, we all knew that you were a bit rubbish, but... Just leaving it to me. A ten-year-old child, or however old I am. Um, okay, so... Oh, are we... Oh, I don't even know. At least I know I'm in the right place. Roughly. Got a star piece right there. Not even bad. Right, let's go. Bow. We're gonna head up here. And we've got Team Galactic people now, that's cool. We grunts have two jobs, one to ensure the success of our operation at the summit, two to utterly destroy any intruders who's to stop their meddling. Okay, well I think you're going to fail at both of those things and I need a drink. What does Galactic Grunt have for me? A stunky, boy am I glad that I put Bear back onto the party. <laughs> Absolutely. Dig! Dig, bear, dig! Oh, this wire is getting in my way. My headphone wire. Maybe I should get some wireless headphones. That might be kind of cool. Um, yes, we defeated you because you're rubbish. And we are the best. We're simply the best. Let's go. Okay, let's do this. Our time has come. It's Team Galactic's time now. Is it? Or is it time for me to just bop you all? You have a Murkrow, so I'm just going to say catch this Aurora Beam. Oh, get wrecked! Get wrecked, Murkrow. Um, I did stop by to the shops as well, so I've got more Hyper Potions, more Repels, more Full Heals. Ah, here we go. Okay, so this is the Summit. This, this, I recognise this now. Um, yeah. I'm just going to try and avoid the grass if I can. Mm -hmm. Although this isn't what I was expecting. Oh, yes it is. Right, that takes me to there. I've got a map, you see, of this part. So it's like... And that climbs me up to there. I'm trying to figure out what the best way is to go. I don't know if it is this way. Oh well. I'm gonna go in here. Oh, these are these are just oh, okay, right, I've got the hang of my map now. It's just telling me where items are. So there's just items here. Okay, right, so we're gonna probably avoid the items. We don't need more stardust. I'll grab these two here while we're here. I'm gonna grab these two here while we're here. Um, it's telling me there's an item here. And there's yeah, I can't do anything about that though. Oh, there's not an item. Well, what? Okay, fine. Um, I can't sur I can surf, but I can't go. Where does that number two lead me to? I have no idea. My maps make no sense. I was like, dude, I'm totally gonna like use a map so that I can totally know where I'm going. But it says that that door, number two door, leads to something else and I can't find the other one so it's like I need door 5 not door 2 where's door 5 where is door 5 it's up there rock climb well, I, could, oh, I might be able to get there quite quickly actually to number 5 possibly HIJ holy crap this doesn't make any sense I know you're just like what are you talking about? Well, quite. Well, quite, exactly. I don't know. I'm gonna go this way. Oh. Oh, thanks for that. Thanks so much. 
<laughs> Thanks for telling me that I could I can't do that on my map. <laughs> Dang it. Right, okay, so let's go up this rock climb wall. A. A? Oh, there's two. I see two now. I see you two. I see you. Um Star piece. This is ridiculous. This is so totally ridiculous. <laughs> right, I go down this way then, I guess. Uh, it's because, right, it's got like all these different colour things on the map, but it doesn't actually have a key to tell me what these things are. So it's like, I can't work out which is rock climb walls. No, grey is rock climb walls. Grey is rock climb walls. A is... No, brown squares are those little rocks. Black squares are doors. Okay. But that's... Yeah, rock climb walls are grey. Okay, cool. I know where I'm going now, I think. Sort of. Round here, there's two grunts. Then we go down. I think blue and green squares are stairs. Through door three. Totally confusing. Anyway, catch this surf hand out while I try and figure out where number three takes me. Oh yes, I'm playing by numbers. Oh, number three takes me there. Not even bad. Um, I'm on it now. I'm on it. I'm going to be finding these galactic dudes as soon as possible. So I've totally been recording for half an hour, but I have got about probably 15 minutes worth of footage. Let's go, Sparks. Let's go, Sparks. Oh, my wrists are a bit sore. I need like a wrist rest. A wrist rest for when I'm recording. Let's just alter that microphone a little bit. Um, thunder shock. I'm starting to get cold again because I've had to turn my heater off. Uh, because it's like not quite cold enough for me to have the heating on all the time, I've just like like using a little heater um, to heat up the room that I'm in because I'm reluctant to turn on the central heating because it's not actually that cold. But it just gets a bit cold when I'm sat around. Um, but it's a it's slightly noisy. So I can't do that while I'm recording. So I like whack it on full heat for like a tiny bit before I start to heat the room up and then gradually as I'm recording the room gets colder and colder again. Okay, and I also need a new desk chair because this one is not comfortable. Um, okay, so we've got another Team Galactic Grunt, so that's taking us around there. Galactic Grunts on this map are exclamation marks. That's helpful. There's not that many though. One, one, two, three, four, five. And then six, seven, and two bosses. <sighs> um, I'm gonna switch into. Do you know what? No, I'm not. I'm just gonna see if we can. We, I'm just gonna see if we can do this with Surf. I, I really want to just power through this right now. Yeah, that's amazing. <clears throat> A little drink. The problem with recording one or two, uh, more than one or two episodes in 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 a session is that I start to like get a bit croaky. That was powerful. You can air cut me all you like, but Martin's just going to eat that up because Martin is power. All these Eevees are power. It just reminds me how much I love evolution. This let's play. This let's play is awesome swords. Okay, right. So we destroyed that Team Galactic one, and we're just going to come around here. So down here. And then, yeah, there's the door. Number three door. Which is going to lead me outside. Excellent. We're going to bop. We're going to whack on another repel right now. Cool beans. Okay, so we're going to go up here. Yep. And down here. There's a door. That's number four. What climb is not going to lead me anywhere, is it? I'm not sure. That door, number four. Where's number four coming out? Yeah, let's go in number four. Let's go in door four. Trainer. Rock climb down. Although, to be fair, I'm not sure if this if I actually need to go this way. I think maybe I should have gone on the rock climbs. Oh, anyway, we'll just we'll tough it out on this with this dude. Got rock climb down. Start B. I don't even understand what that means. Start B. 
start B. I hate this stupid map. Leads to Mount Coronet North. I don't think I need that right now. Aurora Beam! Come on, come on. I need five, which is there. E. I think we need to go back. Um, Martin. Stop being... Martin can't be switched out. Great. Right. Heal you up then, Martin. Seems how. I think you're confused. Um, okay, so... Maybe I do need to go that way. I think I do need to go that way. Yeah, I, I need to go back. I'm gonna go back. I... I think this... I think if I go this... Oh, Martin! I think this way leads to... Oh, come on, Martin. Snap out of that confusion. Yes. I think this way leads to... I think this way leads to so, so, um, a different way that we can't go anyway right now. Um, I think that's for after we've sorted out all of this stuff. So we're just going to go up here. No, this way. You think? Go! I'm going to heal up Martin as well while I'm here. Right. No, not the fashion case. Let's go hyper potion on Martin. <clears throat> okay, right, this way. This way. I have no idea right now, but I'm just gonna I'm just gonna try this. I'm just gonna try it. I do remember this actually from from playing it way back in the in the older days and remember it being a little bit confusing as to where to go. But is it this way? Maybe not. I'm gonna try going down here. My map is slightly confusing, but anyway. You know how it is. Right, I think this is I think this is it. This is it. This is the last the last bit of my journey yeah this is the last bit of my journey that is for sure oh this trainer wasn't on my map our boss is gonna do some huge I'm gonna okay surf really really quickly surf that thing right there pound hour and a glam meow yeah, let's let's bring some more people into this game right now because Martin's gained up a few levels. Let's. I feel like I need to expand on Moonlight's ability. As you can see, Moonlight learnt um, Assurance, which is powerful, more powerful if I get hit first, um, which is fine. You can lower my special attack all you like, mate. That's not going to make an inch of difference to me. I'm going to stick Moonlight up front, I think. Um... That's Martin's 47 now, and that's pretty good, that is. So we need to give the other guys a little bit of training time. Okay, so, I've got another grunt. This grunt is on my map. That makes me think there might be a couple more grunts as I walk around, but we're near to, we're nearly at the boss fights right now, so that's good news. Right, okay, so let's go for assurance on this glam meow. Sucker punch. That's good, though, because that's going to do even more damage. So that's fine. You can sucker punch me. That is absolutely fine. That's that's going to help me to boost my assurance a little bit. And um, we'll just keep gold right in because I'm not scared. Gold. Uh, the only thing that I'm scared of is fighting type attacks. Um, but that's not good. I'm going to confuse the gold button and switch out. I really feel like I ought to see if I can teach Moonlight anything decent. Let's go into Sparks real quick. Destroy this gold bat with a thunder shock. Yeah, you can you can do that all you like, mate. I'm just gonna get you with this thunder shock right now. Yeah, get wrecked. Get yourself wrecked. My Twitter is going mental with people talking about uh, Mega Pidgeot and Mega Beedrill. <sighs> I just want Mega Luxray. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, everybody out there who's going crazy for the for the new newly announced Megas, but I'm just not. I mean, you know, as I said, as I said before, Mega Pidgeot, that's okay. Pidgeot could do with that power, but not 
uh, Beedrill at the expense of Lux. We're not getting Luxray. I know we're not getting Luxray now. I just I know that's not going to happen. But it's disappointing, man. Mega Luxray with dark typing and maybe like strong jaw to make use of the uh, fang moves would be amazing. Okay, so we're nearly there. There's going to be another guy, I think. I think I'm expecting another guy. Yeah, here's the other guy. Here's the other guy. He's waiting for me right here. You've worked so hard to get here. You should be proud of yourself. And now I'll send you packing home. No, you won't. I'll send you packing home. And you should be grateful. Because Cyrus actually doesn't have anything nice to say to you. He's, he's actually going to screw you over at the last minute. He wants this world all for himself. I'm just saying. You didn't know that, but that's his plan. He doesn't actually want any of you grunts. At all. We also got confirmation of the Mega Latias and Latios today. But I mean, those those Mega Stones have been around through Power Saves for a wee while. Um, so it's not that's not news. That's not really news. I was expecting them to be available in Oras. So, but they they do look pretty cool. I quite like them. Um, Crow Gunk, let's go into Xavier. Give you some screen time. I'm slightly concerned because I'm not sure what levels the um, admins are. Is it Mars and Jupiter, perhaps? Got Murkrow as well, so we're going to go straight. To oh no. So I say we're going to go straight back into Sparks, but Sparks has been kind of damaged, so now nah, we'll go in. We'll just heal him up. We'll just heal him up. Make sure I'm healed up before we take on those admins because I'm not sure like how powerful they are. Um, we do have plenty of potions and stuff, so hopefully it won't be too bad, but I feel like we're not quite leveled enough for them. But we'll see, we'll see. And the fact that we've got only five Pokemon to choose from, um, that's also slightly concerning me, but hopefully we'll be alright. We have beaten them before, so I've got my fingers crossed uh, that we can meet them again. I have my most, uh, I have my Eevees here are the ones that um, have got like the most coverage going on, I guess. So let's go Hyper Potion on everybody. Well, not everybody. Let's go not on Moonlight because that's just a tiny bit right there. Um, have we got anything worth giving to anybody? As, is Bear holding an item? No, you can have that Earthquake to power up your dig. Um, no dragon moves knocking around. Same old, same old. Odd incense. Ooh, that boosts psychic type moves. It's, oh no, Xavier's probably holding a mind play or something already. Um, yeah, nothing. Nothing else, so. What have we got? I was just gonna see. Magnet, mind plate, never melt ice, earth plate. Okay, right. It's now or never, guys. So what I think I'll do is I'll switch Xavier up to the front because I think the likelihood is for poison, poison type Pokemon, I guess. And then here we go, Spear Pillar. Our boss is about to do something spectacular. Don't get in the way. Of course you will, won't you? That's why the two of us will team up to take you down in an epic duel. Okay, I'm slightly scared now. Krogunk and Stonky. Well, Stonky's got a dark type move, so that's a little bit scary. We'll go Confusion on Krogunk, and we'll go... We'll go... Double Kick on Stonky. Oh, that didn't do enough, in my opinion. Is it not dark type yet? I thought that was super effective against dark type. Uh, Night Slash, yeah, you're coming for my Xavier. And, oh, you do it in one with a crit. Brilliant. That, that is not fair. It's a good job I bought revives as well. Dang damn it. Um, I'm going to go dig on that stonky. And I'm going to go... Done the shock on that Krogo. Yeah, I didn't think it was enough to take it down in one, but, you know. We're okay, we're okay, we're okay. That's, we're okay. Done the shock on Krogo, and that'll take it out. Then hopefully this dig will take out that stonky. Boo! Super effective. Yay! 
Is that it? One more. Glad meow. Glad meow. Fire fang in your face and we'll thunder shock you as well. Hopefully that's... Hopefully, yes, that's not even bad. Okay. I've been recording for absolutely ages. Um, this is going to be a mammoth episode because even with the cutting out it's still going to be massive. We are not capable of slowing you. We will let you pass so you can get pulverised by our bosses. Bosses. <laughs> is that going to be two, two at once? I hope not. I hope not. Right, Xavier. Hyper potion time. I'm just going to do it on sparks as well because I know that's a bit of a waste but anyway. Right, let's do this then. We have everybody. Where do you think you're going? I won't let you disturb our boss. If you're not going to listen, you'll have to go through me first. After all, you made me look bad more times than I care to remember. And I'll be next. You might be tough, but this time the gloves are coming off. Oh, Butters. Way to go. You got my back, Butters. Well done. Hold on one second. Don't you start the party without me. Huh? Remember me? I'm here to get my revenge. Ha, if it isn't that little boy, the little crybaby from Lake Acuity. Did you suffer enough a bit? Sure, let's battle two on one. Oh, here we go. Two on two. Beck and Butters. Come on, Butters. Come on, Butters. You come through, Butters. It's me and Butters. We've got each other's backs. Right, I'm going to real quick go into Bear right now. Butters has got a Munchlax. Come on, Munchlax. Oh, I see you. Raising, ra going for the screens, raising your defences. That is unacceptable. I'm going to fire fang right now. You die. You die. Rock slide. Ouch! Oh, we ate that up even though we're, uh, it could pretty much, it could hurt us quite a bit. Go on, take it. Oh, come on, Munchlax. Where's the power? Where's the power, Munchlax? We need to bring that power. Butters, why are you, why is your Munchlax not bringing the power? Extra sensory. That's not going to do a lot. Oh, and we flinched. That is fantastic. Right, I am going to take out this skunk tank because I'm kind of scared of it. Uh, come on, Munchlax. We need you. I need you to pull through. Come on. Oh, stop, pile. Wait, you need to you need to do damage on these guys right now. I'm just saying. Come on. Oh. Oh. Holy smokes, Munchlax. Don't go down, Munchlax. You just confused me as well, which is not cool. Um. Okay. Oh, good. The screens have gone, though, which is nice. I am confused. I'm gonna try. I don't want to go for a dig while I'm confused. That's the problem. Because that's two turns where I could like hit myself and it gets spoiled. So yes, we take out the Bronzor. Come on, Night Slash. This, this, this is right here is why I'm not bringing out Xavier because a, a, a Night Slash from that skunk tank would destroy me. I really, really want to go into a dig but I am I am confused I'm just gonna have to I'm just gonna have to try because that's what we need right now I need oh yes oh 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 I see you oh I see you oh and I've snapped out of confusion that is amazing that flamethrower that flamethrower from that I worry about where that flamethrower is coming from as well, because you can see exactly what uh, scunts out. Oh, what? Oh, I thought that was mine then. Didn't take it out. Okay, we've taken him out. We've taken him out. We have taken him out. Come on, Butters. Right, I am going to go, and I am going to dig on that poor ugly. Aerial Ace. Oh, Staraptor hangs in there. Right, come on. Air cutter. Oh, Staraptor, you've gone down as well. Why is, um... Oh, Butters has got a Heracross. Why is, um... Yeah, that's going to destroy the Heracross. Go on, close combat. Oh, you take it out. My dig is going to miss... Oh, well done, dude. My dig is going to totally miss that goal bat. Yeah, that's great. And Heracross is going down. I hope Butters has more Pokemon than that. Because if, if not, oh good, you have a float seal. That's cool. Right, okay, so now we're going to go into spots. Oh, float seal, come on! You need to you need to hit with your attacks, man. You 
can't just, you know, I'm worried. You need to pull your weight, Float Seal. Float Soul. Anyway, okay, so we're doing okay, we're doing okay. Iron Tail. Me and Butters, we've got this. Don't poison me. Ah, oh, dang it. Anyway, one more one more thunder shot should take out that bolt without a problem. <gasps> Come on, hit! Hit! With the iron tail. Oh, you hit. Yes, you do. Me and Butters. What a team. What a team right there. Whoop! You'll be no match for my boss. Haha, <laughs> my Pokemon are tough, right? I can get even tougher, but you know, that's it for us. We've hit the wall. Beck, I, I'll help you with this. What are you giving me? What are you giving me? Oh, you healed my Pokemon. This is it. It's your show now. Oh my goodness. Am I going to have to fight Cyrus as well? Everything is ready for the creation of a new world. Now, all will end and everything will begin. With this, the red chain made from the crystals of the Three Lake Pokemon. And this, the red chain I replicated with technological means. And with these red chains, I will pry open the portal to another dimension. I command that you unleash your power to me. Holy crap, what is he doing? What are you doing, Cyrus? Dialga, the mythical Pokemon and the master of time, and the other, P Palkia, the mythical Pokemon and the master of space and dimensions. Whoa. Whoa. It's all going down right now at Spear Pillar. Just. Dialga, Palkia. I've waited so long for this moment. Dialga and Palkia, shaping this world is a, is a double spiral of time and space. Yes, the very things that you have the ability to control. You will do my bidding. I will have your abilities as mine. With the power I wield, I will create an entirely new world. The incomplete and ugly world we have can now disappear. I am resetting everything to zero. Nothing can remain. It is all for making the ultimate world a complete perfection. Nothing so vague and incomplete as spirit can remain. It's all going down right now, guys. I should have expected as much. Uxi, the being of knowledge. Azelf, the being of willpower. And Mesprit, the being of emotion. The Pokemon have come to protect Sinnoh, pathetic and worthless. It takes the three of them, the three lake Pokemon that symbolise spirits, to balance either the Pokemon of time or space, but they can't maintain a balance against the two. Not when both Dialga and Palkia are here, their coming here is in vain. So much meaningless drama. Now Beck, you've constantly interfered with my plans, but you will be forgiven, after all. There will remain no spirit for all time when I am done. All spirit will disappear. It will be ripped away. From you, your Pokemon, and those precious to you. It is time. My dream will become a reality. What is this pressure I feel? Something is enraged. <gasps> oh, you see Cyrus there backing up. He's like, what? He's backing up. <gasps> what? Hold the phone, what is this? Interesting, so there is a Pokemon that can only appear as a shadow. Yeah, why are you not like intimidated and scared? I am. Regardless, the, re the effort is rash and foolish. I have harnessed the power of Dialga and Palkia. Yeah, he's gonna totally bop you, Cyrus. I, Cyrus, won't have any more interference! Yeah, you've been bopped, man. No! Yeah, look at them. Look at those guys going down there to help. Telling me that they want me to help too, look. Okay, okay. I hear you. I hear you. I'm sorry I took so long. I think I finally found the answer from studying the myths. When this world was made, Zyanga and Palkia appeared, 
Apparently, there was one more Pokemon that appeared at the same time, a Pokemon with as much power as Dealka and Palkia, but also one whose name was never to be spoken, Giratina. It is said to lurk in another world, a world on the opposite side of ours. That's what the shadow was, it must have been Giratina. Giratina? Giratina. The pillars are distorting. It's because of that portal. It joined us to the other world. If it's not closed, the distortion will spread to Sinnoh and beyond. Our world will be destroyed. Are you ready? We have to chase Cyrus. Yes, I am ready. Am I ready? Yes, I'm ready. We have to hurry. Into the distortion world we go. And this seems like a perfect place to stop. <laughs> Here we are. She's going to chat to us, but this is going to be the end of the episode. We'll do Distortion World in the next one. This place. Can you feel it? There are no Pokemon here at all. And time isn't flowing and space isn't stable. A world where the rules are broken. A space one might call the Distortion World. Let's find Giratina. I ne we need to stop it from spreading the distortion at the Spear Pillar. <gasps> da, da, da. That was Giratina. We have to hurry. If something's not done, the distortion world will swallow not only our world, it will overwhelm the distortion world. Damn. Okay, so guys, it's the end of this episode. Sorry if it was a bit of a mammoth one. But uh, yeah, in the next episode, we're going to uh, take on the distortion world and uh, hopefully capture Giratina in um, our Master Ball. And, and we'll be able to crack on with the... Um, let's play so guys if you enjoyed the episode please hit that like button feel free to subscribe and follow and comment and i will see you for the next episode of the pokemon eevee challenge very very soon see you later guys